Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn how we create a Visual Force email template in Salesforce. So let's begin by understanding what are Visual Force email template. You all familiar with the idea behind the email template. So Visual Force email template is also one kind of email template in Salesforce. When we want to render the information conditionally or want to display the list of a re related record, we use this template. And we also use this template for sending the emails with the dynamic content and styling. So let's move ahead and learn to create the visual source email template in Salesforce Lightning component. So here I open my Salesforce account and by default it is open in a Lightning component. So before we will start to learn to create a visual source email template, we will first learn to create a new folder in Salesforce classic email template. For this you firstly have to click on this quick find box and you have to search for the email template. Now click on this classic email templates. Now here you have a button of a create a new folder. Click on this. Now provide an email template folder label and it automatically set its unique name. Now you have to change the public folder access to read and write to make this folder accessible to all the user and finally you have to click on this save button so with this we have learned to create a new folder now we will move back or you can directly click on this new template button so here i click to a unified public classic email template now you here you have to click on new template after that here you will get an option of a visual force. Click on this checkbox and click next. Now select the folder that you want to use to create your new template. So I am going to use my folder that I have created with the name new template folder. If you are already in your selected folder there is no need to select it again. So if you want to make it available for the use you have to click on this checkbox now set the email template name so here i created with the name new contact alert it automatically select the unique name for it now the next one is encoding set it to unicode utf8 add the description and subject if you want as both fields are not mandatory you can leave as it is then scroll down and choose the subject recipient type and related to type so here i subject it as contact details then i select the recipient type to user and related to the contact so scroll down here you will get the contact option so here i select it now finally click on this save button now scroll down and click on this edit template button to create a visual force component and controller so now we will define the code for the new contact alert so here i enter my code if you want to get this code you can directly get it from our website and i will provide you the link of the blog post in the description box now you have to click on the save button to save this so it save the visual force classic email template successfully in the lighting component so if you want to learn how to use this classic email template I will provide you the link of the video in the i button you can watch it from here. So now we will move ahead and learn to create the visual force email template in the classic component as well. So as we are in the lightning component firstly we have to shift to the classic component for this I click on my profile and here I will get the option of a switch to a salesforce classic. So I click on this option. Here I successfully moved to the classic component. Now I have to click on this setup button. Here you will get the box of a quick find. Here you have to search for the email template. And 
Under this communication, you will get the classic email templates option. Click on it. Now you have to click on a new template button. Now again choose the visible force as a email template by clicking on the radio button and click on this next button. After that, select the folder in which you want to create the template. So here I pick up my folder. Now create a template. So now if you want to make it available for the use, click on this checkbox available for the use. Now enter the email template and its unique name is automatically selected. So here I am going to design an email template name as a new account and contact information. It automatically select the unique name. Now set the encoding to the Unicode UTF-8. If you want to add description on a subject, you can add it. It is not mandatory option. Now uh, choose the subject and uh, recipient type and uh, related to. So here I choose the subject as a account and contact info. I choose the recipient type to a contact and I don't want to choose the related to as it is not a mandatory field so I click on the save button to finally save it now you have to click on this edit template button to add a visible force code now I am going to paste the email con so now I am going to paste the code in this email contact box here I pasted the code you will get this code from our blog post and the link is available in the description box now i click on this save button to save this email template so with this we have successfully created the visual force email template in a classic component as well so if you want to learn how you can use this i will provide you the link in the i button or the description box both you can watch the video and learn to use it so with this we have learned how to create a visible force email template in salesforce lighting as well as a classic component and if this video was helpful click on the like button and also subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one thanking you for watching and have a great day